Good evening, family. Uh, really quickly, I have to give us this word. Amen. Um, I was just thinking, I'm sitting here in my office and just overthinking a lot of things and, you know, what's really important. And I'm pressed, uh, I'm pressed to, to give this word, our, our uh, Rema word, our, sp our, our spoken word from the Lord today, this evening. So this word is for somebody, for someone, and it is for me as well. And, uh, and word of encouragement. Amen. So family, think, think about this. When we are confronted, when the enemy tries with you, when the enemy tries with me, when we are confronted with difficult situations, doesn't matter what it is in your household, at work, in the streets, right? Not as not 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 to say that we are running the streets, but you know, just in general, uh, um, when 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 we are out, out and about, mind our own business, right? Any situation confronted with any situation. Right, that tries to pull at us, that tries to uh, bend us, that tries to uh, get get us out of alignment with the Word of God. You and I, as Christians, you and I, are thinking. Hear me when I say this, family. Our thinking always should be the Word of God, God's Word. The Word of God is always our is, is always and should always be our our point of contact. Okay. Our, our point of contact and in and, and the word it helps us you know not only just the, the renewing of our minds but the thinking our thinking patterns and our behaviors it it yeah. it helps us our reactions towards um, any opposition any opposition that the enemy tries to uh, come against us with amen and so let this word uh bless you okay and and again god's word is always and should be our our o u r our point of contact and it helps us because mind you it's not us amen it is not you and i it is the spirit of god the spirit of god the spirit of god that works in it through us amen the word of god okay Always our point of contact. Always our victory. Always. And know who you are, your your identity in Christ. Amen. Know who you are. Doesn't matter what it looks like. Doesn't matter what people think or what they say or what you hear. Any rumors, any of that. Know who you are. Because you are bigger than your enemies. God gave us authority. You are bigger than a situation. God gave us authority. You are bigger than poverty. God gave us authority authority. God gave us word and we decree it. You are bigger. You are bigger. Any situation health wise, uh, any, uh, you know, anything, anything that you may be facing, it will be as God says it is. Okay. But you have to decree it in the word of God is our point of contact. Amen. It is the Holy Spirit that works in and through us. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Receive the word, family. Know who you are, your identity in Christ. God is bigger than any situation. He is the creator of heaven and earth. Your father, your God. We always have victory. We rule and reign over all situations that tries to come against us. Okay? So be encouraged and, and, stand, and be faithful. Be faithful. God is faithful. Be faithful. Give them, we love the Lord with all our hearts, with all our souls, with all our minds, with all our strength. Okay? We have victory. It's already won. The battle is already taken care of. It's already won. And decree his promises in your life. God says to remind him. He doesn't need reminder, but it's for us to remind him. All his promises are yes and amen. It shall come to pass. It shall come to pass. All things your inheritance in Christ. We don't have to wait to get to heaven. Our inheritance in Christ Jesus here on this earth, right here, right now. Amen. Receive the word. Be blessed. Let it meet you where you are. I love you all with the love of Christ. I am infinite child. We will talk soon. Remember, the word of God is our point of contact. Amen. I love you all. Be safe. Enjoy the rest of your day. Peace.